There are five survivors on this lifeboat. What do you want to do? Take them on board or give them supplies? Okay, we found something. We found a thing. We're going to go look at the thing that we found. Uh, it's interesting that I have two... Oh, we've got sight and maximum sight. That's interesting. Yeah. All right, so the loading... The loading isn't as intrusive. There's a quick stutter, but that's not bad. It's really not that bad. All right. Ships. We got ships. We've got ships. Hello, ships. All right, let's see if we can see them. I'm looking for a plume of smoke somewhere. Oh, wait, it'd be off to this side, wouldn't it? Hey, there we go. All right. <clears throat> that looks Norwegian to me. Um, it could be British, but it looks Norwegian. That looks British. That looks Spanish. All right, so it looks like we do have a British ship. We have, it looks like we've got at least one. I'm going to lock that in. She is a bell. She's a bell. Um, is this different now? Is any diff Is anything different here? No? All right, whatever. Might as well get her speed while we're thinking about it. And by go, I mean stop. She's doing seven knots. I can believe that 100%. And we're going to get her angle on bow. Oh, wow. It is pretty much impossible to see this boat. Oh, my God. Okay. Uh, geez. Hang on. I'm gonna have to put a boop, like, um, hang on. Give me red lighting first. I can't see anything. Come on, red lights. Come on, red lights. Help me out. Alright, we're at red lighting, and it's done nothing for me. Okay, I'm just gonna have to sort of pick a spot somewhere. There's like a capstan or something right there. I'm gonna go with that. Now, we don't have the old, um... We don't have the stopwatch from the TDC, so I'm gonna have to use this thing. I'm gonna have to use this thing like back in the day. Just like back in the day. Although I don't actually have to use it, I already got her speed. What am I even talking about? I don't know. Did you set it for darker nights? I don't think I turned on darker nights, no. Make god mode harder. That's very, very possible, yeah. We're just gonna let her go for- I don't even need this on. What am I doing? We just need her to travel a little bit. That's all. All right, maybe it's because it's sort of outside my field of vision, you know what I mean? Like, that actually makes sense. All right, we're just going to put a point there. It doesn't have to be exact. It'll be, I'm sure it'll be close enough. All right, she's going this way. Um, Let's do the old thing stuff. Do hickey. Thing. That. Angle. There we go. 72 degrees. 72 of them. True. I think it's just because it's like outside of my like internal sight because now see this guy I can see perfectly This guy. Yes. He was just in the darkness of my vision. That's impressive. That's pretty good What's with the two sight lines? It looks like That this is your actual what you can see and this is your maximum detectable range. That's what it looks like Whether or not that's true. I could not say now, why isn't that British ship lighting up then? The Norwegian lit up. Is the British ship not a British ship? Hang on. That's not a British flag. She's Norwegian. This is apparently a Norwegian ship. But it's not showing up as a target. This one is a Norwegian ship. So does that mean that one's like a fake? Does that mean it's a fake? All right, I'm gonna shoot the Norwegian because I don't really understand what's gonna go, what's going on here. I really, don't, really don't get it. Um, they're going about seven knots. We know that, so we're gonna go like that. We know they're going 72 degrees. Um, let's go ahead and warm some turpidus. Turpidu warming, please. No, 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 no. Number five. What are you crazy? Crazy. We're actually gonna have to cut this way. Because now, supposedly, you can't fire torpedoes that are behind your launchers. Was it not Portugal? I don't know. It said on the thing that it was Norway. All right, so this one here says Norway. This one... This one says unknown. 
but I'm pretty sure it's Spanish. This one says Norway, but it's flying some weird flag that I have no idea what that is. No idea. <clears throat> if you mouse over it, it'll tell you what you got. It says Norway. This one's unknown. This one is Norway, but it's an enemy. Why is this one not an enemy? So I don't know. I don't know. We're going to find out. We are going to find out, people. All right, steer into target. We're still doing max speed. We want to get our tubes pointed in the right direction at the very least. Um, let's get another one started. Just because. And... I think we're going to fire here pretty shortly. Keep on turning to target. Keep on turning. All right. We're going to shoot. I'm going to take a shot. I'm going to take a shot. Let's see if everything works the same way. Apparently there's new, um, what do you call it? New graphics for explosions and stuff. I'd like to see what that looks like. She is right about their skis. All right. Give me a torpedo. They say they fixed the depth. Did they? Did they fix the depth? All right, this is a explorer. Her draft is 8.7 meters down. So if I set depth to 7.5, this should hit. I'm going to go for it. I want to I wanna see if it's I want to see if it's really a thing. It says depth is not bugged. It said depth is not bugged anymore. So ooh, I don't know. Don't know, don't know. All right, we're firing. Uh, where's my torpedo? Can I not see it anymore? What's going on? Oh, oh, she's a little, <laughs> she's a little green blip now. Oh, they really ramped this up. That's nice. Now, supposedly the camera doesn't cut away when you hit the target anymore either. Um, this feels like it's a little too far out in front. Maybe. Uh, I think we're okay. <clears throat> it auto switches. Cool. Cool, cool. I'm excited. Please don't miss. She's awful deep. I've never set a torpedo to seven and a half meters before. Never, ever have I set a torpedo to seven and a half meters. We're going to find out. What does this do? Interaction. Oh, okay. We could have interacted with it, but instead we're going to blow it up. Instead we're going to kill it. We're going to kill it. Any reason? Because if you hit it deeper down, it should sink better. That's the way it's supposed to work. All right, here we go. Seven and a half meters. Seven and a half meters. Parsifal, what's going on? All right, the SS Baroy. Is there, like, like damage damage now? Can I see anything? Can't see any damage. Cool. Cool, cool. Alright, we struck the Baroy really low down. She's still up. Oh, hell. I'm sorry, chat. I'm sorry. I had muted the, the desktop because I went on break. Ah, I'm sorry about that. Oh, f I can't believe you've done this. Yep, there was all kinds of noises. There was alarm sounds. There was explosions. My bad, my bad. Finding it pretty... Oh, she's, she's abandoned. Okay. Now, can I pick up survivors and stuff? Let's bring the boat up. Oh, we can go to the pontoon, apparently. Alrighty. I'm excited. It's possible. I wonder, like, where do they go? Like, do they just get stored in the ship? I don't know. So this guy is not showing up as an enemy. Uh, it still says Norway, but this is not a Norwegian flag. I don't know what the hell this is. That's got to be a bug of some kind. Oh, new mission. A new mission is near. We're going to go pick up the peoples. We're going to go pick up those peoples. What do you say, Mr. Foreman? We go ahead and sink that boat. Since we're so very close. We're going to slow down. We's going to slow down. Keep the survivors in the torpedo tube. Couldn't find them in your boat? Oh, there you go. Oh. Our empire still like basically impossible to sink. We're gonna find out. Um, I think her health is bleeding down. Maybe. You there? 
I require you to sink. Oh, it's AP. Actually, I should use it. I should use the HE. I have too much of it. It's Portugal. Eh, okay. Alright, we're gonna stop the ship, because apparently... We keep moving during our interactions. We sank the Baroy. There are five survivors on this lifeboat. What do you want to do? Take them on board or give them supplies? Take them on board. Saving the lives of civilians may increase your reputation. May increase. In addition, headquarters will reward you for taking captains of enemy ships. Give them supplies. Now I'm going to take them on board. 100%. Um... It says manage the crew. Okay. Alright, survivors on board. Let's see that. Yep, there you go. We have five of eight survivors on board. Amazing! Look for the captain. Can I do that? Um... Do I not get a list of these people? Um... Uh... Hmm. Apparently I can't actually... Uh, see who these people are. So... Oh, wait, hang on. Uh, no, I can't click any of that. Alright. You get bonuses for picking up the captain. True, but I, I don't know how to tell who the captain is. So, yeah. Try to accommodate them in the limited space of the submarine. We can leave them at the nearest port or supply ship for a small reward. There you go. Oh, hang on. These are our dudes here, apparently. Yeah, alright, they're all hanging out in the crew quarters. Okay. I wonder, can I like... Can I like, go figure out who the captain is? I don't know. The way I fixed my game was to just let them reload automatically. Yeah, I mean, that's one way of doing it. That is one way of doing it. Alright, these are supposedly the dudes. These are the dudes. I can't seem to talk to them at all. Uh... No, that's one of my guys. That's one of my guys. Alright, well, I mean, we know where they are. They're here on the boat. But, we can't seem to interact with them in any way. One eternity later. Turn over the survivors. How the hell do I do that, I wonder? Uh, do the survivors just live on my boat now? Is that... I can leave them at the nearest port. Oh, do I gotta, like, kick them off one by one? Is that what's going on? Bernard Steele. Let's see if we can find him. Bernard Steele, Bernard Steele. Steele, 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 Steele. He's not even listed. Uh... Alright, I don't actually know how to take them off the boat. Life ring. You can click it, but it does nothing. This does nothing. Um... The recruitment officer? Oh, here we go. Brought survivors from a sunk ship. Hey! We made 1,400 budgets for having seven people on board. Alright, folks. Again, that's going to do it for me. It's been real. Uh, until next time, I have been lightly salted. Thanks for tuning in. Bye now.